Hey guys, it's Kiraya, back with another video. Guys, I'm recording this right after the previous video that I made. Um, So, I'm going to be doing this one right after this video. So, guys, um, we're going to be taking a quick look at the Playmates Godzilla and the Playmates Kong. So, I'm going to get these two unboxed, guys. So, give me a quick second. Um, not surprised that Kong is being... Easy. Okay, the feet might be a bit difficult. Come on, Kong. Gotta work with me here. Um, okay. Alright, guys, give me a second. I'm gonna have to literally rip this box open. Jeez. Oh, you cannot make life easy, can you? Yeah, now I'm definitely voting for Godzilla. Well, yeah, by the way, guys, tell me down in the comments who you guys think will win between Godzilla and Kong. Like, my predictions are that either Godzilla is going to kill Kong, Kong will kill Godzilla, or Kong will bow to Godzilla, which I highly doubt. That's, like, my least, like, that's the last one I'd expect. Like, that, those would be my only predictions I know. Alright, Kong's out. There we go. Guys, I literally had to rip that box open. But here he is, out the box. I gotta say, very nice compared to the Axe version. Um, definitely, um, his mouth is closed on, like, the Axe for Oh, shoot. Um, let's just put you on the box. But, I would say he looks pretty well. Um, obviously doesn't have his articulation here. Or the battle damage, like, the, uh... Battle Axe Kong, but pretty good overall. Um, feet, I'm pretty sure articulate. Yep. And the legs. Arms articulate along with the fists. Um, head it can turn. I'm pretty sure it can't do a 360. I don't want to rip its head off, so I'm not going to do that. I'm going to get this guy unboxed now. He's going to be way more difficult. And I mean way, way, way more difficult. So, wish me luck here, guys. Okay. I know I might vote for Kong now. Godzilla, it's not that difficult. It's just... Just the tail, guys. Give me a second. Oh, yeah, and guys, the reason why I'm not uh, cutting ahead is that way you guys can tell that I'm doing it in actual time and not, like, cutting ahead through the video. So... That's why I'm doing it like this. Um, and the reason why I'm putting my phone down is because I don't have anywhere to stand it. And I don't want to risk showing my face while unboxing these things. So, that's the reason why I put, I'm putting my phone down. Uh, let's get this tail on. Give me a second. Come on, big G. There we go. Alright. So, here Godzilla is. Oh, come on. Come on. Just stand for me. So here Godzilla is out the box. Um, gotta say, I'm very impressed with this. The only thing that I'd say I don't like about it is that there are no screws on this side here. And then there are, like, tons on this side. Like, 
down to here, and then there's even one right there. So, like, it, from a front view, you're really looking at, like, a giant hole. Um, hands are articulative, but they don't like to turn, so, like, it might, like, you might need to literally turn it once, like, give a big turn, so that way then they'll turn. Like, this one doesn't want to cooperate, and it's very loose. Like, as you guys can see. Um. So, my guess is they might make another, like, I was hoping that, like, I'm hoping maybe they'll make a battle axe for this one as well. But, I highly doubt it. But, I think it's definitely possible. Um. So, we are calling it sized up with Godzilla. But, not on a flat surface. Um. Like, I think they actually Kong is taller. But in the movie, Kong should be probably about like this, I'd say. Or no, about there, I'd say. Like, but here are the two giant figures are. Um, I'm not good with unboxings. <laughs> um, but Godzilla now, his articulation is practically the other one. Except he can move his hands this time, and the other one can't. He can move his feet. I'm not... I don't remember if the other one can, but I'm pretty sure it can't. And then it's tail. And I need to say it right now. This tail, way better than the small one. Um, hold up. Let me... Actually... No, I remember. Um, I was gonna grab my small one. Um, but, like, if we look at it... If we compare these doors opens, like, how it goes to here... Like, it's way better than the other one. Except this little gap right here. But apart from that, this one's way better than the smaller one, in my opinion. But that's just me. Um, and then I would say, I honestly prefer this one over the small Kong. Simply because, like, they're just way easier to, like, handle. As far as, you know. But... I'm going to end off this video here, guys, so thank you all who came in this video. I hope you all enjoyed it. If you did, make like and subscribe for more content just like this, and this crew I hit now. Hope you all enjoyed the video, and I'm going to be now have to record the skull crawlers. So, see you guys in a bit. Peace out. Have a great Christmas, guys, and now I'm going to have to get this skull crawler one recorded with six. So, I'll see you guys in a bit on another video. Um, so, yeah.